The Minecraft game teaches you how to write code using conditions. A condition means when something is true in a statement, then something happens. If you look at the new blocks in our toolbox, we have a repeat until goal. So whatever blocks you put inside of it will keep happening until you've reached the goal. We also have an if standing on a blue coral block. If this statement is true, then the blocks inside are red and the computer does what it says. Same thing with if standing on a red coral block. If this statement is true, whatever blocks inside of it will be read by the computer and the task will be conducted. So what's going on here? Let's read our directions at the top. It says, you made it to the reef. Now search for the heart of the sea. Use the blue and red coral to reach the treasure chest. All right, so the first thing we need to do is find the treasure chest. That's right here. Then we need to find the blue coral right here and the red coral. There's coral there and red coral there. So we need to use the blocks that we have in order to get our character to the treasure chest. So let's look at the game space here. He needs to go to this corner and turn. Then he needs to go here and turn. And then here and turn, here and turn. We'll keep going here, 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 and here. So we have these blue corals and we have these red corals and different things can happen when we hit those corals. So the first thing we want to do is say, okay, let's do this. We're going to repeat until we reach the goal. Well, of course he has to move forward. So that seems like the obvious answer. And then something happens when he stands on the blue coral and something's happens when he stands on the red coral. Well, what's going to happen? Well, if he's on this coral, he needs to turn right. If he's here, he needs to turn right. If he's here though, he needs to turn left. And if he's here right, here left, here right, here right, and here right. So now we see a pattern in the pathway that Alex is taking. So we're gonna do a turn right if he's standing on a blue coral. We're going to change that drop down and a turn left if he's tanning on a red coral. So if we're reading our code, it says repeat these steps until you've reached the goal, which is the treasure chest. If standing on blue coral, then turn right. Otherwise, go to the next step. If standing on red coral, then turn left. Let's run it and see if our code works. Turn right. Now he's going to turn right again. See how it's lighting up the blocks as it goes through the code. Turn right, turn left, turn right, and see how he's moving forward and running through that loop over and over again. The computer's just following the directions and he reached the goal. And that's how you use conditionals in Minecraft.